<clears throat> well, you saw Lil Wayne came to John ja Moran's defense too. <laughs> he said, uh, "We've all been young before." He said, "What?" He said because they asked him about you know Josh ja showing that gun. He was like, "Oh, we've all been young before." Trying to excuse it, <sighs> like everybody just got two hundred million and acting crazy. Nah, I just think he need to leave some people around him. He need to cut some people off, bro. That's the only way you're going to stay at the top and continue to be at the top. If you want to be business, mind, if you want to be around hood niggas all day and do that, man, do that. But don't waste these white people time that's giving you this money. You, your face value is BS to them. You slapping the NBA in the face. Now the NBA is finna be watered down. You can't bring the, the rap to the NBA. It was cool to come out to the music and get hype. But it was about sports. It's not about sports no more. It's all about rap, bro. And it shouldn't be like that. Now the boxing, you got the rappers coming out with the boxers. It's cool for us looking, but if you think about it, it's not cool. Let the music play and come out and whoop a nigga get whooped and go home and get y'all money. But see, we can't call these rappers. You know what I'm saying? You got every rapper want to come out with them, bro. That shit ain't real to me, man. That shit fake. It's fake as a rattlesnake, man. And a rattlesnake ain't fake, but they fake because they fake rattlesnakes. It's like that dude on Hustle and Flow, he said, he itching back there. He said, he itching back there. He said, I'm right when I'm wrong. I'm wrong when I'm right, but I know when I'm right when I'm wrong, man. And he was right, man. I'm telling you, man. Man, you better start thinking. Thanks for watching this clip. We just hit that 17K subscribers on our way to 18. So make sure you hit that subscribe button right now and we'll see you next time.